shopping biceps are ready. I just don't know how it's gonna look on. Hello there beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are doing well. As you know, I'm still in the US of A, honeys, and I've basically been taking advantage of some of the stores that I see online all the time, especially stores that I know nothing about. So today I decided to do a kind of supermarket sweep tour of Target. Now, Target is a store that I know jack all about. Me going into Target is about to be the newest thing I've ever done, although I know it's really, really popular. I don't know if it's high-end or low-end or cheap or affordable. I don't really know anything about it. Is it a makeup store? Is it a clothing store? Is it a chicken shop? Is it a discount warehouse? I don't know, I don't know. So I decided to go out and about and do some shopping in Target. Da -da 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 Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Yeah, I am being the crazy British girl <laughs> in, a, in a whole America. So today we're gonna go into Target, I believe. Target is one of those stores that I hear about all the time. And you know, I've got FOMO. What am I missing out? Do I really need to be, you know, enjoying and spending some money in Target? Maybe I do need to be. So, we go and do it today, people. We go and do it today. The stairway to Target Heaven, people. The stairway to Target Heaven. Why is it upstairs? It's actually kind of strange to me, but you know what? Let's take the stairs to our destiny. There's an escalator right there. Huh? There's an escalator right there. Oh, is there? I'll take the escalator. Oh, there is. <laughs> Shopping biceps are ready. Can you see them? <laughs> Huge trolley. What the hell am I buying a house? It's massive. Got a lot of stuff. You reach the goods real quickly. Um, like the beauty eyes here are actually epically large. Milani, Milani, we don't have you. I have to order you on Amazon at a premium. So hi, hi Milani, hi. In regards to the foundation, we have porcelain light, light natural, light natural, creamy vanilla, creamy vanilla, natural, light beige, light beige, medium beige, medium beige, natural beige, natural beige, sand beige, sand and tan. Um, of which none of the shades I can wear. So I'm gonna move on. Is it any good? I need to do a video with full face of brands I've never heard of or tried before in my life. You can do that out here. Why is no one talking about these brands on YouTube? Hold on, I think we have a black aisle here. A black aisle. We don't have a black aisle, unfortunately, back at home. The fact that I saw someone with a head wrap on in a mainstream store. Oh my, God. this is development. No, this is actually like the black hair aisle. And it's massive. I'm in satin bonnet heaven. If I could get a, I have the drive to get a satin bonnet. And we've got it right here in Target. Wow. So I can't lie. The clothing is giving me pensioner with swag vibes. So, I mean, I might just have to stick to some beauty. I'm gonna see what I can find here. But you know, it's a little bit, you know, not exactly my style. Should, I'll just put it as that. Like I, I, I'm getting the idea of significant fupa and just I don't know, little house on the prairie. But let us attempt to see what we can find. <laughs> Do you know what? I kind of like this adult baby. This is giving me my mom when she's like, I bought something very nice. Like oh yes, mom. High rise jeggings, fitted hips and thigh. I like that. Oh yes, high rise hot shots, hey, hey. Get the food popping these. This is a vibe. Pew. <laughs> that was actually quite hard painful. <laughs> we have arrived in the land of shoes. There's lots of sandals, some browns. I've got the summer vibe coming on. And I actually do want a pair of shoes. So I'm gonna try and find a pair. Let's see. Um, 
so many options. <laughs> this is my worst kind of hair. This hair, this to me, this is no. This is be a flat, don't be heel. It's not a wedge. No, not a wedge. You can buy stuff for your bathroom in here. Do you need a towel, sir? Do you need a toilet, sir? Do you need a pot, sir? Do you need a gold ice cream scoop, sir? You need a hat, sir? I actually love these. So that's it guys, that's a wrap. Target, you were lit, I was feeling that. I got my goodies here, I even got some berries and they were divine. Okay guys, I am back from Target and um, I've got some goodies. I'm gonna call it Target. That makes it sound a little bit more fancy, honey. We've been to Target. To be honest with you, I didn't know what to expect from Target because I haven't ever been there before. And so I thought it was a clothing and makeup store. But I was 100% wrong. It's not a clothing and makeup store. It is, it is, I, I can't really decide what it is. It's like a hybrid of everything. You can get groceries there. There was a coffee shop. There was clothing. There was books, electronics, pots and pans. And just everything. So I literally have nothing to compare the store to. Uh, it's kind of like a, maybe a department store, but without the, the departments, or maybe it is a department store, maybe it is a department store. However, I actually enjoyed my shopping experience in Target. Let, let's just let's just break down departments, because they had wine. There was wine as well, as wine and wheelchairs all in the same place. How? No, there wasn't any wheelchairs, but yeah, who knows? There probably was somewhere. So firstly, me being a beauty girl, I was astounded by the beauty collection. There was so much beauty. I've, again, never been into Target, and there's like, you know, your classic brands like my L'Oreal Parises and Maybellines and all that kind of good stuff, but there were other brands there that I hadn't seen before. So I picked up some of those makeup brands, and I've gotta say, I feel like the makeup department was stacked. Like, there were rows, the light was shining. I was convinced that I needed to buy a lot of stuff there. I ended up finding some products from like Sonia Kashuk, don't know who that is. Maybe I should need to. I don't know. I found another brand, Profusion, super, super affordable. I was able to pick up some Milani that I've been really, really wanting to pick up as well. And basically, it was a well stocked drugstore section of beauty. However, let's not get into the foundation shades. That is going to be another video. Maybe I'm going to do a full face of brands I don't know about from Target. But yeah, that was a little bit of a struggle over there. But I felt like it was a nice beauty department. Not only that, we got into the hair section. I'm from England. Yes, I'm from England and I am black. Um, and you, there's no way that you'd go into like a hair section or like an Asda and really find like products or like black hair. However, they had that stuff there. I was shook. All I needed was to find some wee thread and a needle and I would have been and some bond glue. If I had some bonding glue, listen, we would have been ready. So that was really exciting. After that I went to go and pick up some clothing. So here's all my clothing. We're gonna try a lot of the clothing. I didn't buy that much clothing just because I was a bit like mm, not so sure on it. It was kind of giving me a little bit grandma vibes. A little bit. Little bit, little bit dated, little bit, little bit dated, little bit dated in there. But it was calm, it was relaxed, the layout was cute, and I was able to find some gems. So we're gonna try on some of these gems, and I'm gonna tell you what I think of the goodies. So first thing, we're gonna go with these little ripped denim shorts, $19.99. I'm really hoping they're gonna fit, because they're size double zero. But um, I feel like their sizes look like they come up a little bit larger. Let's just roll and see what these look like on. Okay, so <laughs> having a, a look at these, these are, they're wow, they're really a wow. They're quite, I like the style of these. They are too short. As you can see, I'm just getting that roll. You know when shorts are too short? This is the roll that you get. It's just not fitting in the right place. And oh, I feel like I definitely needed to size up. I'm not gonna let you guys see the back because we have 
We have cheek coming it coming out. We have cheek. We have actual cheek. Maybe if this was Coachella weekend, I could rock with this, but it's not Coachella right about now. So these actually are a nice fit of short. However, they're too small for me. Um, but the fit's cute. I actually like the fit. I'm wondering that if it was a size up, that you know whether or not we would be having cheek coming out, you know, or whether or not we'd just have upper thigh. Not entirely sure, but they're not they're not a bad short. They're not a bad short. Listen, my bum, my bum is actually eating the shorts. They are eating the shorts. Eating them alive. <laughs> they are being shopped. Right, these are another pair of shorts. I thought they were nice. I thought they were cute. Yes, I know I'm in short season. I'm in LA. I'm trying to be all, you know, <laughs> boohoo and floaty. So these like floral-esque shorts. Ah! Can't get these off. Literally can't get these off. Oh god, we're stuck. We're stuck. Ooh, I love these. These are giving me like little house on the prairie, but with but with but with a little edge, but with a little booty. I really think these are cute. These are um actually quite a small size. I think the sizing in Target comes up kind of large. But these are actually nice, like, they, I wouldn't wear these back at home, but in LA with a little espadrille, you know, I would rock a little floral denim short. $19.99, don't think it's too bad, and pricing is actually quite cheap, to be honest, especially, like, for a retail store. I like these, my booty's giving me slight snatch as well, which I think looks mad good. We like it, okay, Target. So, um, this little number came about because I was trying to find like a dress or something, but listen, I, I just wanted to pick up something like dress wise just to give you guys an honest opinion on it, but this is what I could find. I mean, they tried to add a little bit of, you know, sass with this little hole right here, but I, I just don't know how it's going to look on. Is this a trouser or is it, oh, it's okay, okay, it's a culotte, it's a culotte-esque, trouser-esque jumpsuit. Let's let's see what this looks like on. Okay, okay, okay. So I was kind of gonna start singing Kumbaya as I put on this outfit, like Kumbaya, my love. Kumbaya. Wait, anyway, Kumbaya. It was giving me Kumbaya vibes. However, this is so comfortable. It's actually unbelievable. It's slightly maternal. It's slightly kumbaya, but I feel really good in it. I feel like this is like, where's my beach hat? I picked up a beach hat. Where's the beach hat I found from them? I found a beach hat as well, but I feel like this is just like go on holiday, you know, chill out. And I have a confession. It sounds really bad, but I do spend a lot of time sucking in. They take a photo, you go, <gasps> you know, because you just want it to not look, you know, uh, and you guys know my sensitive area is my belly. Um, because that's where oh, all the pies get held. However, with this wonderful number, I can breathe out. It feels, it feels good. It feels so good. It feels like I can breathe out. I can live. I am breathing all the way out. And I feel like lunch baby's not on show. I mean, I like the way I feel in this outfit. That is what I'll say. I like the way I feel. For $29.99, I don't hate. I feel like I'm a salesperson now. For $29.99, you can get yourself a maternity ass jumpsuit, whether it's a real baby or a lunch baby. This is the jumpsuit for you. Everything just fits comfortably in the right places, and I just want to sway. Sway. Sway, honey, sway. Ooh, okay. I wanted to try out the denim. The denim selection wasn't giving me denim vibes that I like. It was kind of giving me Primark denim, but you know, sometimes there were some, some bad boys in there and had a nice stretch. And then I just wanted to find a top as well. This is just, ugh, we're adding to the Kumbaya territory. But also I feel like, cause I'm in LA, I'm picking up stuff that's got more of a vintage, like flowery, like chill back vibe. So this is giving that, or it's kind of giving me mum's tablecloth. We need to see this on. <laughs> Funny enough, I feel like I used to dress like this, like back in the day. I feel like I need to go back to this. I feel so much at ease. My belly doesn't have to suck in. I feel relaxed. My abs are like, <sighs> we're free. I'm not having to suck in with this bad boy. I'm not having to tug or pull. I feel really comfortable. It's just comfort clothing. I like this. And I love, this is giving me vintage vibes that I am really, really into. 
I mean, I feel like it's not my style. This isn't my style, to be honest with you, not anymore. But I feel cool, I feel comfortable. If this is your style, you can definitely rock it. Secondly, look at the jeans. Look at the jeans. They're giving me a little snatch. They even had the energy to collect in the muffin top. It sucked it in. It's, it's holding in the muffin nicely. Whoa. Okay, booty. This, maybe because it's low rider, I'm giving myself like Britney Spears circa 1999. It's just that like low riding, like small area for the booty. I don't hate it. I don't hate it. The jeans are actually quite a nice fit. They're actually quite cropped. I like the lining on. I like the way the lines are on this. I like these jeans. I really do love these jeans. I think they're buff. I think they are absolutely hot. Finally, I picked up some swim. I don't know if I'm going to put these on. We'll see. We'll see what this looks like on. I don't know if we're going to need the sensor right here, people. This... This bikini is lifting the girls from the shadows and bringing them together. Wow, it's a really... Oh, wow. We are really lifting the girls. They're lifted and together right now. I can't even show you the bottoms because the bottoms will be getting me demonetized. They are doing Brazilian snatcheroo in the crotcheroo. Um, yeah, <laughs> I like the swim. I love the color. This like burnt orangey red. Yes, I I feel very comfortable in this. It's like the girls are secure. They're lifted, brought together, but they're secure. I like this. Find me on the beach somewhere, darling. My boobs are lifted, the girls are happy. I'm a fan, I'm actually a fan. So that's the clothing. I went to the shoe department. There weren't many options in the like really, really stylish shoe department. If you just need something a bit more casual, run around shoes, there's something there. These are the sandals I picked up. I've actually already been wearing these. I know they're a little bit, you know, auntie-esque, but I'm telling you that these saved me. These actually saved me during Coachella. So yeah, I picked up these bad boys and they're all right although we're starting to lose a little bead i'm going to tell you that i love these they kept me they kept me going i put these on i slap footed well well these can hang but for me from a style perspective the shoe department wasn't really cutting it and finally i just tried to make my way out of the store where i picked up a hat a little hat look at this look at this hat darling like i picked up this hat and it was giving me actual target swag i love it i love it who doesn't want a straw hat I don't know, for me, I like a straw hat. And I was like, I haven't got a straw hat for the year. And this was cute. I'm down with the hat. And finally, I picked up some strawberries on the way out. So yeah, I was doing everything <laughs> in Target. Um, overall, I think it's a great store. Why not? I would love to have a Target in the UK. I feel like I'd be there a lot. And their stationery section was live and I'm a stationery fan. There's such good stationery there, so. I don't know how you define it. I don't know, but I like Target. I'll be there again. And for all of you Target shoppers, enjoy. I know some of the clothing can be a little bit dated. Little bit grandma, but I have seen worse. I have seen worse. So guys, that is my take on shopping in Target. And I probably will do a video of a full face of like products I found in Target. So if you want to see that video, give this a thumbs up if you enjoyed. And if there are any other stores that you feel like I need to check out while I'm here, let me know in the comments below because I can do it. I'll, I'll do it. If you're not following my Instagram, make sure you check me out there. You can see behind the scenes what I'm getting up to. And you can also follow me on my Twitter where I do respond to you guys as much as possible. And for those of you guys who've picked up your merch and i've started to receive it yay i love your pictures please keep sending them to me please 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 i'm going to be reposting and retweeting i'm just getting them all i know i know i've been slow i know i've been slow but i've got you guys i love you all thank you for watching and i'll see you soon bye i've already been gone i've already been gone i've been gone you people